Welcome back to the channel everybody and this is my quick review of uh, Lego's Lamborghini. Check out this. How cool does this look? Now I bought this uh, off of eBay uh, at the time of this video is being made. It cost me £23. Absolute steal. You're probably asking, why do you like this uh, Lamborghini so much Jim? Well, this reminds me of the Lamborghini. If you've ever seen the film Cannonball Run 2, at the beginning of the titles, there's these uh, two very sexy ladies, brunette and a blonde, that are driving around in one of these and they're trying to escape the police. And uh, this looks just like that. And I can't understand why um, Lego haven't marketed this as the Cannonball Run or Cannonball Run 2 car. Um, I'm just thinking maybe maybe because the film's too old because it came out in the 80s. But um, yeah, that's why I like it so much. So I thought I've got to go and get it. So, as you can see, this car comes with uh, that little minifigure there, a little chap, and uh, he also has a crash helmet. I'll show you that. There's a little crash helmet that he comes with. You get a spare crash helmet with that. You have to stick the visor on. It's all pretty good. You also get the uh, obligatory st uh, spanner that comes with the car with the guy as well. But, um, yes, the, the build itself then. The um, build was pretty easy. Um, there were some very clever bits that Lego have done to to the build so that you can get the curves of the car because the Lamborghini even though it is an 80s car let's just take him out of the way there are some curves particularly at the rear of the car if I just turn that round I'll turn it all the way round you can see there the rear of the car and the curves and look at that how cool is that um, quality again for the, the for the price what you're getting is an Quality is brilliant, as far as I'm concerned, it's brilliant. I'm um, really happy with the, the car itself. Playability then, so if you're uh, an eight year old, so I'll try and knock my camera over. Um, yeah, you can play with this. Not too many parts are gonna fall off. Um, I've, I've had a little drive around in it and um, nothing's really fallen off of the car. Not like some of the Lego builds that you can get. Um, you can take off the windscreen or the windshield if you're American, and have a look inside the car. It's got just the normal steering wheel, gear stick, and you can stick two Lego minifigures in it. So if your little minifigure's got a girlfriend or boyfriend, you can stick them in the car with him. I've built mine as a right-hand drive. If you want, you can build it as a, build it as a left-hand drive. So, um, yeah, it's pretty good. Bad points. So the only drama I have with these Lego builds, some of these Lego builds, is the stickers. Now the stickers themselves aren't too bad. I'm just gonna turn the car around because you've got some stickers on the front of the car. So you can see, um, if I get my pointer, hey, let's have a look. So you've got your stickers down here that go on the front of the grill. There's also some that go underneath the headlights and obviously the Lamborghini badge on the front. Now, if you're like me, and you're getting a bit old in years and you have trouble seeing it can be a bit of an issue applying the stickers especially if you've got big sausage fingers like myself as well so it can be a bit of a pain and if you're a little kid say eight years old nine years old and you're trying to put the stickers it could be quite frustrating and that's the only downside um, that does my head in because there are stuff there is stuff on there that's printed on um, like for instance on the windscreen so that's actually printed so yeah that's the only thing that does my head in slightly. I'll just show you on the back there, you can see it says Lamborghini Contash. So um, yeah, that is, for anything, that's the only bad point. I can't understand why they just don't print it on. Um, yeah, it does my nut in. Um, price, like I said, this these now, you can pick these up on eBay. They're going for about 23 pounds. And for an iconic car, the Lamborghini, they're well worth the price. So, if you haven't already bought yourself one, I would get yourself on the eBay and get yourself an awesome little car and uh, yeah, an iconic car. So with that being said, I'm going to end this video here and uh, just leave this car here for you to look at. Look at this, absolutely gorgeous.